Hi again. I'm now going to show you first how to make a concentrated stock solution of sodium chloride and second, how to make a diluted solution from it containing exactly 0.85% of sodium chloride. What do we need this time? Sodium chloride comes as a powder, distilled water, a measuring cylinder, some perfume, a funnel, and two bottles for our solution. And of course, a balance. A spatula, and a weighing boat. But first, we need to calculate how much sodium chloride we need. My final concentration is 0.85%. Therefore, the tens times concentrate is 8.5%. A reminder here, percent means grams per 100 milliliters. Therefore, in 100 milliliters of solution, I will need 8.5 grams of sodium chloride. So let's go and weigh it now. I need to turn on my balance, check it's clean. Give it a little brush. Okay. Put the empty weighing boat inside and cancel its weight by pressing the tear button. There we go. And then we can weigh our sodium chloride. Sodium chloride. Go. Okay, so I have my eight point five grams of sodium chloride. Let's now put them in the measuring cylinder. Carefully. There we go. Then it's usually a good thing to wash the walls of the weighing boat with some water to collect all the grains of powder, in this case sodium chloride. Not to lose our precious powder. And now add distilled water to make our 100 mils. because I need to be precise. I'm going to get the meniscus touching the 100 milliliters line. And so I'm going to use this bottle to get it right. There you go. Now I'm going to stretch some perfume over the top and give it a good mix. That. Okay, I think I mix it enough times. The sodium chloride is fully dissolved. So now I can put it in, into my bottle label stock solution. Let's remove the paraffin. Here we go. 
So my stock is ready. I now need to prepare the diluted solution. So back to our calculation. We just made our stock of 8.5%. But what we want is a concentration of 0.85%. So what do we need to do? We need to dilute the 8.5% 10 times to get 0.85%. So this is a 10 times dilution. To do so, we need to put one part of stock solution into nine parts of water, which will give us the 10 parts of my final solution. But because I want 100 milliliters, I will then have 10 milliliters of stock and 90 milliliters of water. So we're now going to put 90 milliliters of water into a clean cylinder and add then 10 milliliters of stock solution. So let's put our water first. 90 milliliters. Let's do this precisely now. Same thing with the meniscus. And now let's add 10 milliliters of the stock solution to complete until 100 milliliters. As before, let's mix it and put some paraffin on top. And then pour it into our final bottle. So here we have our working solution and the stock solution. Good, so I can now do my experiments. <laughs>